MLB The Show has baseball now on a Sunday afternoon at Miller Park in Milwaukee. Today we wrap up this four-game weekend series between the Cincinnati Reds and the Milwaukee Brewers. Milwaukee attempt to end a six-game losing streak. Next. Play ball. Three. Stepping into the box, number 87, hoping to stay hot. He had a couple of hits, including a home run yesterday. First offering on its way. Line drive to left. That gets down, and the inning continues. Boy, this guy is off to some kind of series, and he's one of the better road hitters in all of baseball. Dan, some guys just have a knack for lighting it up on the road, getting that good night's sleep, and finding a way to get to the yard early and work on their craft. Batting four. At the, the plate, base. Nicholas McDermott. Nicholas. He'll get to take his first Nick cuts Dermott. here. Runners on the move for second. Got him swinging, and that will end the inning. One left for Cincinnati, and now the Brewers will get their first cuts. No score. Digging in, number 87. He's coming off a month in which he earned National League Player of the Month recognition. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Fouled off. A swinging strike, and now it's 0-2. Hey, boys, you talk about getting your A swing off. That's what it looks like right there. A guy with massive power letting it eat. Count moves to a ball and two strikes now. The 1-2. And he fouls this one off. Here he comes again, 1-2. Lifted in the air to center. Pedroza moves over. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Now in the box, number 87. He's one for two in the ball game. Number 87. First pitch of the at bat. Hit hard to the right. Foul. Oh, one pitch on its way. Fouled away. Wind up and the 0-2 pitch. Another one sent foul. Keep battling, young man. Three foul balls in a row. He is calibrating that heater and the off speed. Let's see if he can catch something on the barrel. And it's fouled away. The 0-2 once more is looked at for ball one. I can't blame him one bit out on the mound. I'm shocked he didn't pick up the rosin bag and see if he could get a foul ball on that one. He had to see if he would swing way outside the zone. Line towards center field. Pedroza has to roam straight back, but he has it for the first out. Digging in the switch now hitter, back. number 87. Number 87. He's seven. working on a one for three thus far. First delivery to him on the way. Fouled off. Tying run at the plate, the 0-1. Well struck down the right field line. 
And that is off the wall but in foul territory. Foul ball. Here's the 0 and 2. And he fouls this one off. Another 0 2 home. Fouled away. The next 0 2 is belted and take a look at this deep to right center field and it's gone. Solo shot to right center and just like that this ball game is all tied. Boy, this guy's hot right now. Hit a bomb yesterday and hit another tape measure shot today. When he gets hot, he hits him in bunches. This could be the beginning of one of those extended hot streaks. Trying to pick things up where he That's left off. Number Juan 24. Pedroza has got a chance Whoa. to end this one and Pedroza. send these fans home happy if he can get a ball deep enough into the gap. A bouncer oh to the left side. Throw on to first, gets him, and the side is retired. Milwaukee leaves one. Score remains tied one to one. So digging in now, number 87, as he'll hit with the go-ahead run at third and two away. And going back to that previous at-bat when he hit the two-strike breaking ball for a home run, something tells me that this guy, when he gets behind in the count, sits on something off-speed or the breaking ball. Now a line drive to left center field, and it's going to get down for the base right, hit. Hold it there, hold it there, hold it there. the runner from third, and they've taken the lead with a run here in the 10th. Dan, you'll take RBIs any way you can get them, but when they give your team the lead in the late innings, man, that feels good. Oh, it especially does, especially when you start to score runs late in the game off of quality pitching. When runs are at a premium, that's one that makes you feel now really good about yourself. The first baseman, Nicholas McDermott. Well, they miss with the first one, but then they decide, let's go ahead and put him aboard here. And they'll do just that as you see the signal from the dugout. And this is the right move here. With first base open, take the bat out of this guy's hands every single time. Standing in, Byron Buxton. And he's got an opportunity to turn this narrow lead into a wide one if he can cash in here. The one-two pitch. Line on, keep, through, keep, through, keep going. Acuna is there to make the catch and they'll escape the bases loaded jam by giving up just one run. So one run on three hits, no errors, and they leave the bases loaded. So now we'll see if these guys can get even in the bottom of inning number 10. It's the Reds two and the Brewers one. The batter, the left fielder. The Brewers Red. down to their final strike. Justy. A swing and a ground ball to third. Throw on to first is going to be in time to take care of them. And the Reds have run their winning streak to five in a row now as this ball game is over. Hey, it took them an extra frame to do it. But, hey, they're not going to complain as they lock up a nice road victory here in ten innings. Pitching and defense game, two to one, the final score this afternoon. Alvaro Alvarez claims the win out of the pen his first. Clarence Fletcher earns the save out of the bullpen his 14th. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com.